I mean, it's it's not you know, the baby formula versus breastfeeding. Yeah. Kind no, of. but but this is even worse. This is like uh, at least baby formula has all the essential ingredients. Fair. Right. Fair. This this that didn't even. Have. It's like it's like all you're eating is rice. Mm. You're you're gonna get wrecked. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You know. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. The populations are declining. Okay. Something like 40% per year. It like rapidly. Rapidly, dude. It's it's the losses in 2025 are projected to be around 60 to 70%. Okay. And this comes from a variety of factors. It's environmental, climate change. Yeah. One of the other big ones is the, a core nutritional gap between when you have these like colonies that are, that are um, sort of reared by beekeepers. Um, there's a nutritional gap between what the beekeepers can give to the bees and what they actually require. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And um, it's been really hard to actually bridge that gap because what, what they're really lacking is these things called essential sterols. It's like cholesterol and other types of like fatty acids that are really hard to synthesize in a industrial manner. Mm -hmm. Cause a lot of times what the, what these beekeepers do is they, they're not relying on like the, the flowers, mm -hmm to feed the bees they have like artificial yep. like you know feed yep but um you're, you're not able to fulfill the entire nut nutritional needs yep okay and that is what this paper is addressing what they did was they bioengineered yeast to make all of the essential oils that bees require this is okay fascinating right yeah. and the results are dude absolutely insane the the bees that had this particular feed 15 times more viable pupae like okay. 15 times yeah. more viable 15 x 15 x not a 15 percent no not 15 percent 15 x this is a paradigm shift yeah no this, this could like save save our ass this dude. is this is a really yeah big deal this could this could enrich colonies continued to rear the the brood yep. for like 90 days up until the the experiment ended and then they were like okay i guess we got our data because because these guys were just going at it right and before it's the, the pupae, the larval stage was the part that was getting affected right. because they're the ones that as they grow, they really require yes. these, yeah, yeah, yeah. these nutrients. It